Hello everybody, welcome back to Back Out of the Case with Skyflight 44, aka Zek 44, and today I'm playing some more Pokemon Silver, partially randomized. All the trainer's Pokemon, randomized. All the TMs, randomized. All of my Pokemon, specifically selected, but I got them all from the very beginning of the game. Now, uh, let's just say, I've been having some good luck and some bad luck in the last few videos. And nothing for bad luck says was worse than that freaking Butterfree that um, put all six of my Pokemon to sleep at once. And that wasn't that. I was that was just no good. Uh, do I have Jiggly out? Yeah, I believe I do have Jiggly out. Probably gonna want to keep Jigglypuff for those uh, Electros, to be honest. Granted, I believe I'm probably going to be uh, hurting by the time I actually get out of this place anyway. Spiro. Huh, do you have flying type Pokemon or normal type Pokemon? Uh, let's just go with extreme speed and another one to see. Oh, that, that, that's nice damage. Actually, probably could have went with an Oxyzooka then an extreme speed. So it was the same result, just uh, I would save myself an extreme speed. Okay, flying type Pokemon. Granted, I can actually go and defeat Gligar with Jigglypuff. Oh, and I believe this would have been its, uh, his top Pokemon, level 24. Wait, was the Spear level 24? I don't really remember. But, uh, this is actually... Oh, shit. Ah, quick attack. I, I either have to... No, nope, don't, no, nope, no chance. Let's go and see if we can actually defeat it with, uh... Damn it, Poison Sting! I wanted to see if I could actually go and defeat Gligar. Um, just with Skip Room. Damn it! Ah, I want to get a synthesis off. Okay, now I was kind of just completely screwing around. Now let's actually do some work here. Well, that's good. I completely forgot that uh, Leech Seed does that. Really? Well, at least I'm gonna get a little bit of uh, health back. Oh, this last part. These last few trainers have been absolutely brutal. Come on out, Hound Doom. You're gonna defeat this Natu and you're just gonna laugh in his face like a hyena. Oh, this this is still What the fuck? I mean Jigglypuff, that that was kind of that was gonna just gonna happen. I'm just being stingy with my actual uh, items, that's it. That's it, really. Now, let's see. Uh, we'll put out Houndoom first. And hopefully we can survive this and the Electrodes. Wrong stairwell. Actually, uh, Super Potion and Croconaw. Houndoom probably doesn't need it, but I wanted to make sure that uh, Croconaw can actually, uh, you know, has full health. Croconaw has some defense to it, and Houndoom doesn't, so self-destruct from Electro is going to go straight through Houndoom, no matter whether it has full health or not. Mainly because they're both the same actual, what was it called, uh, 
same level for the most part. Now two more freaking executives to beat. Oh, that's right. Lance is gonna beat one of them for me. I find it funny how that uh, Team Rocket executive there. It's probably an executive just goes to goes right in front of the uh, exec the female executive. When we all know Lance is a freaking uh, Dragonite. You're not really showing too much. Ah. Let's go to Krokona. This is going to be interesting. But uh, we all know that uh, there's no way anybody's going to stand up to a freaking Dragonite. This is going to be a lot of experience for Krokona. Granted, I still want that... I still want that Mega Drain. I still want that Mega Drain. I would have gotten immediately the XP share. If I could actually... If I still had a hop up that is, I would go immediately for the XP share right now. But, um... We can still use Skip Room. Don't worry. That's just going to be a bit more of a pain in the ass. Now throw out your last Pokemon, bitch. Marowak, oh fine. You are going down. 25, cool. Actually, I am going to take a shot at the uh, next gym leader. Granted, his Pokemon, last Pokemon is going to be at level 32, but, um, what the hell. Uh, let's just go for it. That, that is, we have to see what type the gym's going to be. If it's one of the types we're good at, we have one Pokemon that can probably sweep through them. Fine. If we don't, or it's one that might be completely detrimental to any kind of win I'm planning, I might not go and do anything else. I might just uh, run out of it and... Uh, Go and finish up the entire Ampharos thing. Granted, uh, I wish I'd fly. Yep, now let's go kill some Electrodes. Electrodes don't need to survive. Electrodes don't need to live. Uh, no, it does not make me guilty in the slightest. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna be going with Zatu on this. I think Zatu can probably go, you know, do two side beams and then maybe take out an electrode. Hopefully, if it doesn't actually go and do self destruct, I can, uh, you know, survive this. Granted, the only thing that's really going to be all that difficult to actually. Survive is self-destruct. Ooh, confused. That's actually happened more than I thought that was going to happen in this playthrough. Maybe like three times already? Did not think that Psybeam would actually have done that so many times. Never really happens to me. Okay, another one. Round two. Is it going to do self-destruct or not? I know it does have self-destruct. I mean, poor, poor Electro. It's all scared. This master's left him there. Just for the hell of it. Completely used. Just for electricity. And then, as it's cowering, it, as it's cowering, it's going to blow itself up. Probably just so that I can actually go and, uh, you know, put itself to sleep. But I mean, self-destruct doesn't kill it, it just puts it into a coma. They're about the same thing when it comes to Pokemon. They can both be healed out of sleeping comas. 
Now, last electrode. Are you going to do self-destruct too? Or am I going to take you out before then? Ooh, Sonic Boom. Oh, shit. Hope it does another Sonic Boom. I believe Tube Surf can take out an electrode. Oh yeah, critical hit. That that was great. Now let's go get uh what was it? Waterfall, I believe? Or no, whirlpool. Waterfall we go and get uh somewhere else. Where do we get waterfall? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right! We get Waterfall in the uh, Ice Cave place. Actually... I wonder if I can actually... Uh, no, I'm probably gonna need Waterfall to actually go and, uh... Get, um... Lugia to begin with, so... I was thinking to myself... Now that I can pretty much go and get Whirlpool and, uh, you know, actually go and, uh, beat the seventh gym, I could probably do something like that. Now I wonder, w will, um, if I actually go and defeat the seventh gym, will I immediately go and. Sh can I go on to the eighth? And more importantly, can I, um... Will I actually be called up and told that, uh... The, what was it called? The... Okay, Croconaut, I'm gonna put you out and put pound him. Will I actually be called that, uh, Team Rocket's taking over Goldenrod? I, I doubt it. It's probably gonna have to happen once I take out, well, all seven gym leaders. Kingdra. This is either a water type gem, or this is going to be a dragon type gem. If it's the latter, we're fucked. If this is the former, hallelujah. Oh, if that thing has a uh, dragon rage, I am so screwed. Oh, please just hit with leech seed. Oh, thank you. Good night. Yeah, Leech Seed is going to take a lot of your health and just add it on to mine, just so you know. Damn it. I've already been smoke screened twice, so I, I might as well just go and use the um, moves that have a shitload of uh, actual... PP. Oh, a bubble. Oh, shit, that is that is so deadly. I'm not going to actually have to. Uh, not going to have to worry about it. Come on, King Dress. That all you can do? No dragon rage. You would have beaten me by now if you had a dragon rage or at least skip bloom. Yeah, poor, poor Kingdra is being completely destroyed by all of my, uh, nice little... Oh, and I get a gust in, finally! But I was completely destroyed by my, uh, leeching moves. Now, gonna be changing him out of there. The, our Houndoom's gonna be needing to get out of there, definitely. Um, Skip Bloom can probably do another fight. Uh, now, is it water or dragon? And it's dragon! Oh, shit. This is gonna be interesting. Oh. Well, you could have helped me out there. Skip them Dragon Rage. See? See? These guys know what they're doing. Why didn't that 
freaking Kingdra know what I was doing? I know for a fact that it learns it, I believe. Synthesis is gonna give me over half help, so, uh, or at least over 40. Now I can go for a poison powder. I'm just trying to get Skip Bloom to actually survive this one. Um, this one's Dratini. Granted, you really want to know what this entire gym's going to be just completely Dratini. Which is uh, probably one of the most, uh, well, screwed up things about it. That means Thunder Wave everywhere. Yeah, Dragon Rage. I know. I know. Well, no matter what I actually do... Oh, cool, I actually beat it. But, uh, no matter what I would actually do, I would, uh, pretty much not be able to really do anything there. Dragonair! Holy shit, Dragonair's in the house. Um... I'm gonna go with Zachu. Twenty-five. I don't like the way this is going. Everything's gonna be either the three of those Pokemon. If they have a Dragonite, I'm going to freak the fuck out. Not to mention every single one of my Pokemon's gonna be Thunder Waved. But I really, really want to see that. What what's gonna happen? Am I actually going to uh, be called out for a golden rod or not? Because that's what happens to me all the time. Did I, I go the other way first? Uh, yeah. I'm not liking this. A dragon type gym. Granted, this is a seventh uh, gym leader that we're going to be facing again. We might as well actually have a dragon type gym. You know, getting close to the end of the game, but... Damn, did not think this was gonna happen to me. And I'm going, I'm going back to the Pokemon Center a couple of times. This, this is very interesting. This it really is very interesting. Huh. To be honest, I really don't have the Pokemon for this. I said I was gonna, you know, just run. But I hope that, uh, Pylosmine's actually... Uh, changed into, uh, what was it called? Uh, Kingdra, and not an actual Dragonite. If it's a Dragonite, well then, I'm gonna have a quite a fun time with that, but I don't want to have a fun time with that. Actually, Kingdra, if it's like the first one that we fought, we have absolutely nothing to worry about. Now, let's go and put Jigglypuff in the front. I can probably beat one more before I actually go and, uh, heal up. Jigglypuff would be nice. Granted, I, I, like I said, I, I still have extreme speed. Extreme speed really is going to be useful if something like a bullet, well, uh, Dragonite comes along. Actually, I would love to have, a. Uh, I'm gonna be going and doing Thunder Wave any anyway if I actually face off against one of those. Flaffy's gonna be my big Pokemon there. But the interesting thing, like like a Jigglypuff, uh, Jigglypuff's not gonna be too. Uh, it's definitely not going to be the worst Pokemon I actually go and uh, pit against an actual Dratini or something because of Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage isn't gonna be all too bad. Kingdra. Uh, let's go and put out Flaffy, actually. Uh, I really wish I could use Skip Bloom. Um, actually, let's see. Let's go and use Skip Bloom. If I can get off a Leech Seed, I probably should be able to defeat it. Now, if I'm not actually paralyzed. Oh, yes! I can actually defeat the Kingdra. I, I really just want to defeat as many Pokemon as I possibly can before, or many trainers as I possibly can before I actually need to go and heal. So I don't have to do that too many times. Oh yeah, here's a smoke screen. 
but I generally always have a tough time with the 8th gym to begin with, and now this is actually going to make it even weirder, because this is my 5th gym as a dragon type. And this entire game has been full of surprises. Full of good surprises, mind you, but, um, full of surprises. Well, now your turns are numbered, you stupid Kingdra. I mean, for the most part, we've seen all of the moves it has. Water Gun, Bubble, Smoke Screen, Leer. It has no way of beating us. Oh, why did I do Poison Powder again? But, uh... Looks like Skiplum's actually getting most of his health back. Damn, Gus didn't work. Oh, fine. Skip Plume, you're awesome. Don't let me tell you otherwise. A thousand experience. And a Dratini. Um, yeah, let's go back to Jigglypuff. I'm gonna wanna s see if I can get a good magnitude in, and then go for the extreme speed. Okay, let's go with the second magnitude. And, yeah, then after that, extreme speed. If I can, even if I get a seven, I'll be able to do this. Oh, an eight, even better. Yeah, an extreme speed will be able to uh, cut right through that Dratini. And with that, all we really have to do... ...is, uh, go and... Uh, which one should we use? I'm gonna be using, first out, Houndoom. Oh, really, there's only two more that we actually have to beat. Whoop, not going that way. Please, give me an actual good Pokemon to go and beat. And hopefully, I won't actually... I, I won't suffer. Uh, Dragonair, cool, Dragonair. Okay, I'm going to be using extreme speed the entire time. Because hopefully, if I actually do this right, I can actually defeat the... N oh, shit. Nope, this is going to be a little bit harder. Going out, Skip Plume, Leech Seed, uh, possibly Poison Powder if it survives, and then... Uh, th this is all if it doesn't actually go and get hit by uh, a Dragon Rage, but uh, if that might happen, um, I could probably actually beat... I, I can uh, switch over to... What was it called? Uh... Damn it! Okay, I'm calm, composed. Skip Plume went down for nothing. Let's uh, think. Um, let's go and use Flaffy. We're going to be using Thunder Wave and then Strength the entire time. This should probably help. I mean, if the next Pokemon, the next train is another Dratini, um, another Dratini, Dratini, and what was it called? Kingdra. We've that. That's an easy one. But well, this is a really, really interesting gem. And one more. I, for the most part, just have Houndoom to my name. Houndoom, uh, Zatu doesn't really have any health, but, uh, Crocona and the Flaffy. Dratini, cool, Dratini. Now, if there's no Thunder Wave, Houndoom, Houndoom can still be quite useful. Shit. 
should have kept my goddamn mouth shut. Fully paralyzed. I would have taken even freaking Dragon Rage. Okay, hopefully I can actually get another extreme speed in to whatever the next Pokemon is. Oh, another Dratini! I do have two of these. Now if it does, I hope it does another Thunder Wave. Twister, Twister's fine. Uh, if I don't actually get paralyzed, Extreme Speed's gonna win this for me. Good work, Houndoom. And now we actually go in here. I definitely want to go in here. Definitely want to go in here. Our next fight is possibly might be the hardest fight we've gone and done, you know, done so far in the entire game. This was a fighting type gym, even if it's an ice type gym, this would have been easier than what it is now. I mean, I've, I I would be able to get maybe like an Ampharos if it was the uh, ice type gym. And that Houndoom would have been, uh, you know, looking nice too, but not not this. Oh, definitely not this. Now, I'm going to be putting out Jigglypuff first. It's probably going to start out with a Dratini or a, maybe a Dragon Animal. That would be definitely the worst possible. Uh, thing to actually have, but um, I'm looking, I'm um, hoping for a Kingdra in this. Kingdra would definitely be the best opponent for, you know, like the super strong type. Uh, okay, good, a Dratini. Uh, hopefully Dratini, Kingdra, and uh, at the least maybe a Dragonair. I do not want to actually go and face a Dragonite. Oh, did not affect? That generally never happens. Cool, Jigglypuff survived the first round without actually going and getting screwed over. And a level 24, too. Cool. A uh, double slap? Unlikely. Kingdra. Okay. Now, I could go skip plume. And actually, I, I will go skip plume. A 29. Okay. Uh, this replaces the... I believe he had a... a dugong. That's probably what it does. This one has Twister. I'm probably going to change it uh, to... Well, I really don't have to change it, but probably should change it to a uh, Croconoff. Now that did 26 damage. Looking at it, uh, 13. I'm not going to be able to get the necessary amount I'm going to need. Maybe I should go and change it back. Yes! Skip Plume, you had a good thing going for you, but uh, Twister's just too much. Now Croconaw. Croconaw can probably uh, go one-on-one -on -one with it. Strength, definitely. E even with Smokescreen, it's been leech-seeded, it's been uh, poisoned. That's all good. Not to mention, it's just getting hit with the strength. That's awesome. Hmm. Nice. Now, one more. Oh, damn it. Well, it doesn't matter. After this twister, that's it. Oh, this is some good music. Ooh, shit, that's nice. 
good. Okay, now let's uh, let's go to Flaffy. I'm definitely go. I'm gonna go with the Thunder Wave. Uh, hopefully, Strength if it actually goes and uh, oh, Double Thunder Wave if it actually goes and successfully beats off um, Flaffy. I'm just gonna end it with Hound Doom. That's just gonna be what, uh, that's what I'm gonna hope for. Okay, let's, uh, go off to Zatu. Because obviously, strength's not gonna cut out. Not gonna be able to destroy this dragon. Oh, shit, in a dragon rage. I never liked dragon rage. Okay, let's go with Nightshade. This should destroy within four moves. Okay, it should destroy in two more. Now, Nightshade definitely is useful in these types of situations. Oh, crap. Granted, Dragon Rage would be much, much- Oh, fuck! And I just thought to myself, this might actually go easier than I thought it would. And then it has to immediately go and do the hyper potion. Why the hyper potion? Fully paralyzed in the dragon rage. Huh. That two might make it through. I don't I really doubt it. Hey, Zatu actually won! Thank you, Zatu! You wasted the Hyper Potion, bitch! Ugh, a Dragon-type gym. What did I just go through? Yeah, yeah, what are you gonna give me? That's all I wanna know. Okay, and what are you gonna give me? Oh, 16. What is it? Morning Sun. Uh, let's see what can actually learn Morning Sun just for the hell of it. Morning Sun. Croconaut can learn Morning Sun, yet freaking Skip Plume can't. You shitting me? Wow. I am tempted to actually give that to it. Now let's see. Yeah, it's gonna be a while before that. See everybody.